So I guess we're going back to our choice of Robin to explore the ending. So we're gonna make him die. We're gonna make him die? Oh wait, no. Oh, I already clicked it. Oh yeah, and then we'll go back and we'll make him be saved. We save lives every day. Strangers. And there's always enough time. But you already know how I failed to save Jason from this life. What you don't know is how I failed to save him from the next. Red Hood. As always, Nightwing had other ideas about him showing up at the exact moment I need an extra hand. <laughs> or fist. <laughs> it seems fitting that Nightwing was there the night it all began. The sniper ended the interrogation, laid out the red carpet to follow him instead. He led me to the factory, that place, where the Red Hood died. Joker was born. My first great failure. He was sending me a message. And it echoed Bosnia. Factory. Explosion. I cleared Joker. my mind by focusing on the facts. The Amazo heist and reports from Nightwing showed the Red Hood was taking but over the crime syndicates of Gotham with deadly it's force. Part of the mystery. Some of Gotham's most wanted slaughtered. Drop the body. <laughs> it's got the chills for some reason. I was wondering, I'm like, dang, he's gonna let the helicopter fall on the ground like that? What are we doing? Nightwing's like the best part, man. Here it is. Nightwing's ability to evade us was irritating. Advanced parkour, counterattacking on the run. He loves his explosives. He to escape my grappling lines. Nobody cuts my grappling lines. <laughs> Oh god. Dude, how many explosives? It's like everything's laid out for him. Because of my choice, my mistake. Dick was injured. I couldn't even look him in the eye. Oh my god. I finally caught up to him. He was barely surviving an ambush. Is that Lantia? Is that Mira? Or am I crazy? Outnumbered four to one by high tech assassins. Oh no, it's not me. I thought she was near because yeah, I thought that was a water weapon. Like the water source cow they be making. As familiar as Jason's when he fought at my side as Robin. Is he crying? He wants to talk to him. He knows it's Jason. But then he crossed the line. Just to make a damn point. He was cleaning up Gotham by controlling it with deadly force because my way didn't work. A familiar argument. The body I brought home from Bosnia five years ago was a fake. How could I not have looked inside his coffin before we buried it? Stupid and careless. It was clear that Raish was deeply grieved by Jason's passing, as was I. He found a way to steal Jason's body for submersion in his Lazarus pit. The Lazarus pit was obvious. I was prepared for that part of the story. And I realized the true reason I confronted him. I wanted Raish to be responsible for the Red Hood. I wanted to blame someone else. The Red Hood was a nightmare of my own making. Broke the Joker out of Arkham to hire him to kill the Red Hood. Of course, unpredictable as always. Black Mask quickly found himself hoisted with his own petard, tied up in the back of a trailer and soaked in gasoline. Sure enough, Joker got rid of his attention, but getting Joker out of Arkham was Jason's goal all along. Jason Black Mask is a fool. Really oh my god, and that's a brutal death. Because you don't die right away when you're on fire, you just burn. I remember this part of the original movie. I, mean, I couldn't be late. 
down. Red Hood, this Red Hood, and Titan. This is who we're getting in Titan season three. Red Hood. I can't wait to see this. And this time he's gonna go up against Dick, so that'll be interesting instead of Batman. Deadly. We finally removed the helmet. He's like, I'm gonna look you in your eyes. For that moment, I was just a father again. I begged him to stop, to let me help, but he wasn't done. And was wearing a, a bomb helmet at the time, for when his mask got taken off. Even dying didn't teach him he was wrong. There was no more reasoning, no more holding back. He wanted pain. I was ready to unleash it, ready to drag that kid through fire, through hell and back, to show him once and for all his contest wasn't with the world, it was with himself. Jesus. The moment he'd been planning for five years. To kill Joker. Who is it? Do I hear an uh, interactive feature coming in? Do we get to choose what happens to the Joker now? I remember that. He said, How could you leave this dude alive after what he did? He said, If he would have killed you, I would have killed him. But you said, Then he put him lock him up. I remember that whole choice. Him between our ideals. He, uh, kill Joker, or kill Jason to stop him from killing Joker. Oh yeah, I remember that. <laughs> As he, he blows himself up. Oh, oh, all three of us dying. It would have been cool if we got to choose it's a Joker and Spade. Stop fighting to protect them from themselves. So who is he talking to? To protect them from me. Clark? We only come to know the true power of evil when we work to suppress it in ourselves. You know, when you say spooky stuff like that, you justify my contingency plans to defeat you. <laughs> what I'm saying, Bruce, is that you're the strongest person I know. Your willingness to open up to me about this? Well, that shows real strength. And the day you stop reaching out for this support is the day I know I need to activate my contingency plan for you. <laughs> we'll find Jason together. How do we get to the other endings then? Huh, so unless the third option has all the other options, where the heck? I'm confused. 